Idara ya polisi huko Gidunguri imehimiza, imehimiza wananchi watoe habari kuhusu shughuli zozote wanazozishuku ili kukomesha visa vya ujambazi vinavyoshuhudiwa katika eneo hilo. Kamanda wa polisi huko Gidunguri Mary Kaimenyo amesema kuwa wakulima wameathirika mno baada ya visa kadhaa vya wizi wa mfugo na mazao ya kahawa kuripotiwa. Magari vile vile yameharibiwa katika nyumba kadhaa kwenye eneo hilo. sisi wa ngombe hapa eh sasa ukiangalia ndugu yangu alikuwa anajimudu tu na hiyo ngombe moja sasa hana kazi ya kufanya hata kusudi dio upati hapa hana kitu ya kufanya kwa boma zikitolewa siku ana lakini bali pen zilitolewa nilienda nikacheck nikayakuta kama wamevunja kofuri kwenye tunafungia wapi ngombe na igao wanatoka hawakutokea kwa geti waka wakavunja fence We've had a spate of robberies in this area uh, over the last two months or so. We were able to cut away about 350,000 worth, uh, worth of goods, yeah, especially veterinary uh, equipment. Definitely demand for them to, to give us uh, enough security and do patrols because that's another thing that's not happening. So you find motorbikes in the dead of night ferrying all manner of things and you wonder who are these people working at night yeah so they need they definitely need to do more patrols in the area and uh, make sure everyone is safe we are taking measures to ensure that we have security and we normalize the activities within this sub county expatriates uh, who participate uh, or who get involved in crimes action stand action has always been taken against them They have been arrested and taken to court and fined heavily, some repatriated. And on the other side, we have also urged the members of public to, to ensure that they vet the foreigners who come to work and be sure that they are people of good behavior, people who cannot steal from them.